Hello everyone, what's up? It's Master Adventure 200 here, and oh boy, I'm finally getting the chance to sit down and talk about this, because I'm telling you this right now. This video topic has been driving me nuts for the past few days. Like, I would say since last Saturday? I would say, like, I don't remember the specific day, but I think it was Saturday where I was freaking out because like what I'm what I'm about to talk about is literally seeming like that this could be like one of one of my favorite things to happen right now so first off the reason that this video is late is mainly because I like a little side note I went to see Avengers Infinity War and I saw that Monday and it is currently what day is today currently it's the 6, which is Wednesday. I saw this movie Monday, and I was emotionally compromised. I I needed a day or two to literally gain back my emotions because that movie had left me drained. Um, it, it was not it, it was not a pretty sight for me on Monday. So yeah, I I, I needed a few days to kind of get back into the groove. So I was like, okay, I'm good now. Like I'm good. But immediately afterwards, immediately afterwards, I see this. And I put it up on Twitter. I might post uh, the thing. I'm a, I'm a, I might post my tweet um, if, I, if I really wanted to. But if I do, there you go. If it's not there, then I'll just, uh, let's just get into this. So, I think, it was, I think it was Monday or Tuesday. I don't remember the specific day. I, I just don't remember... Or it could have been way before, actually. I think it was actually on Saturday. Um, yeah, it was Saturday. Yeah, because that's when I was freaking out. Um, I was watching... I was. I think it was on on uh, the internet. And I turned over to my head. I looked to the right, and I looked at my TV, and I was like, oh, Big Hero 6. I think it was on um, Disney Channel. I think it was Disney Channel. Um, yeah, it was. And it was the TV show. For people who don't know, there is a Big Hero 6 TV show. They're not making a sequel, or at least they don't have any interest to make a sequel. Um, which is fine, because Big Hero 6 is a... Uh, it's about superheroes, so it kind of makes sense for it to be a TV show. So I was like, okay, Big Hero 6. I, I remembered it had an episode, so it was a pilot, because that's the background for that. It was a pilot episode... I guess I get to see if it will draw in people. It did. I think it also was renewed for a second season. So that's pretty cool. But I look over and it's the TV show. I was like, oh, okay. I didn't see the first episode, but I should check it out. I did. I thought it was okay. But the thing that hooked me was that it was the date of when this episode was dropping. And I freaked out a little bit when I saw the date and it was June 9th. Now, for people who aren't aware, the Kingdom Hearts Orchestra this year for 2018 is happening this Saturday on the 9th. Um, I don't know when it's going to happen. I have no idea when the timestamp is for the orchestra. Um, it, it's you know, like I tried reaching out to someone to see if I could know that information for the LA uh, Orchestra. Sadly, I didn't get a response. It's no big deal. Honestly, I, I, I don't think it's... I don't think it matters anymore about what I'm about to say. Um, so I was like, oh, that's a little peculiar. And then I went to check and I was like, okay, it's the same day. I was like, okay, maybe it's just a coincidence. Maybe it's just, maybe it's nothing. Um, and the reason I was freaking out was mainly because if you, if you lived under a rock, the old orchestra from last year gave us a trailer where it teed up for, of course, D23 with Toy Story and such. And the thing about the thing about history, the thing about life, is that history loves to repeat itself. So I was instantly thinking, could they have another trailer where Big Hero Six is showing off? And I started thinking. I started. I started talking to my girlfriend. I was like, okay, this is a little coincidence that they're showing this at the same time. But then I immediately remember, and I was talking to her about this, and she's probably watching this video. Uh, also, it, she's going to orchestra, if you're watching this. Hope you have a great time. Um, wish I could do the same. I wish I could go. <laughs> um, but I digress. 
and the one thing she brought up was that Toy Story was played the exact same day as D23 when they showed Toy Story, when they revealed it. And I do remember that happening. I do remember tweet a tweet going out um, that Toy Story 2 was on TV. I was like, this, okay, this is starting to look up a little authentic now. But that's not all. Freeform, of course, if people don't know, Freeform, which was known as ABC Family, was actually showing Big Hero 6, um, which was also on Saturday and Sunday, back-to-back days, along with Zootopia, but then again, like, I digress with that. And Freeform, I didn't know, I didn't know Freeform was owned by Disney. I didn't know that. I actually was fully, I I was flabbergasted. I didn't know. (laughs) So I I saw that they were teeing up like a Disney kind of weekend where they were showing a lot of Pixar and Disney movies. So I I took it and I was like, and that could really be a coincidence. They're showing a lot of their movies that's under Disney, that's under the brand. Like, okay, Harry Potter does the same thing. I was like, okay, that, that that seemed a little bit more coincidental. So I was like, okay, I'll let that go. But now I... Now I've now I'm glad I'm glad I waited to do this video because now what I've written down literally a couple hours ago was that Big Hero 6 the movie is also playing on Saturday June 9th and I have it here not not only is it playing Saturday it's playing Sunday so let me read let me read this word for word so for the movie Big Hero 6 Saturday on the 9th, 6 p.m. my time, which is central time. You can calculate that to whatever time zone you're living in. So for mine, for the movie, it's 6 p.m. central time. And for Sunday, June 10th, 9 a.m. central time. But the show, I actually kind of saw this a bit. I didn't know how valid this was. Apparently, it's not just the premiere since the first episode they premiered uh, the, that they showed off in November of last year that was more of a pilot with kind of two episodes linked together which was Baymax's return um, which kind of you could separate into two parts but they showed it in one that was more of a pilot I'll let that slide so this is technically the premiere which is happening Saturday June 9th for my time 8 a.m. but that, that's not all apparently they are having also episode three appear in the same day literally 30 minutes after at 8 30 a.m and then sunday at the same time eight o'clock a.m for my time episode four and then 8 30 the same day on sunday june 10th episode five at 8 30 a.m so i'm just looking at all this i'm looking and every time that I look at the TV or I look at the news for Big Hero 6, it just seems way, way too close. Like, I, I'm, I'm being serious. Like, I, it would be stupid if it wasn't the case. Like, honestly, we have not seen Big Hero 6 in moving action. We have only have one concept art, and that was back from 2015 literally years ago and we've only heard about big hero 6 most people forgot about it and most people thought that oh it's just probably going to be cut but i knew it wasn't cut because it kept getting talked in interviews uh very briefly Uh, and even um the voice actor for baymax actually kind of talked about um his role about he probably doesn't want um other people voicing Baymax because he I think his words were pretty much it would sound weird or it would seem weird for him to watch Baymax be voiced by somebody else so maybe it could be possible that the voice actor for Baymax I don't remember the name off the top of my head um, he more than likely I hope will come back for Baymax if he doesn't or Disney doesn't contact him Disney you messed up (laughs) you messed up but um I'm just I'm looking at this and it's like if this is if this doesn't actually become a thing, I'm gonna uh, like I swear on my life I will I will make a paper L and take a picture and post it on Twitter, 
And I would be like, okay, it was all coincidence. My L. <laughs> I will I will openly say it and I swear it on my life if that happens. And the way I could see this happening is that they open with Big Hero 6 at the orchestra, which apparently they're showing two, they're apparently doing two new songs, which don't know if that's going to be new songs from Kingdom Hearts 3, if it's going to be just old music just now finally being orchestrated, I don't know, we, nobody knows, really, but imagine that they just open with Big Hero 6, excuse me, another burp, just imagine if they open with Big Hero 6, and it leads into a trailer like it did before, with the old orchestra from last year, and then they literally tease for the next trailer where it's like, during E3, watch as we present a new world, or new worlds, and the release date, if they don't do it at the orchestra. Honestly, the release date's supposed to be early June, so it really could be 50-50 on either the orchestra or E3. To me, it doesn't matter. They could literally do it either way, I don't, I don't care. They say early June, it's like, if it's at the orchestra, great. If it's at E3, great. Doesn't matter. But I could see that happening at the orchestra with them teasing New Worlds and a release date with showing Big Hero 6 in the new trailer at the orchestra. Because history loves to repeat itself, not just in video games and just how marketing works. I mean, this is perfect marketing for Big Hero 6. Just, Disney, you would be stupid enough not to do this. Like, come on. Uh... Yeah, like, history loves to repeat itself. I think I've gotten everything I want to say. Uh, 12 minutes, I think that's pretty good. <laughs> I think that's pretty good for a quick, short video. Um, I don't know, what you, uh, let me know in the comment section below. Do you think Big Hero 6 is going to be shown at the orchestra? Uh, do you think it might be shown at E3? Um, and what other worlds do you think that you would want to see that could be very plausible? I mean, Big Hero 6 is one of my favorite films. So I'm really excited to see something. I, I think that's probably why I'm so hyped. is because I really, really want to see this world in action. I want to see Sora fighting alongside Baymax, Hero, and the rest of the Big, uh, Big Hero 6 team. Like, it's just... I don't know. I just... I love that film so much. I don't know why. It's just, it's just one of my favorites. But all in all, I think that's all I have to say. Until the next video. Until the orchestra. If there's going to be a new trailer... Um, hopefully it's not the opening. I really hope it's not the opening. Please keep that away until the re until the release. Please, Square. Please and thank you. I don't want it. Please let it be bigger, Big Hero 6. And, yeah. <laughs> uh, until the next video. Until the next trailer. To the next video that I do. Actually, I probably want to do the, um, demo stuff. Because I really want to do talk about the, uh, E3. Uh, not E3 want to talk about the Kingdom Hearts premiere demos and such. I, I'm just trying to map that out. Um, but until then, until, the, until those videos, till the next trailer reaction, to the next piece of content that I put out, I'm Master Francis Warner, signing out next time. See you everybody. Have an awesome day.